hopping up in that Porsche. Dick bitch, no torso, just cakes. See that pastry, that ushy gushy, I can't see my hands. Just me and my mans in the strip club throwing money, call it battle of the bands. And I'm What's good, y'all? It's the Underground Undisputed YouTube with the King You Tech JD to die. 7 a.m. I'm tired as fuck. <laughs> But of course I had to stay up, go to the midnight release, get Black Ops 2, play a couple hours, and let you all know what I think of the multiplayer so far. Now, for a typical COD fanboy, they're going to like it regardless, no matter how much they complain. You can't really take an opinion from them serious, you know, because it seems like all they want to do, even though it's their favorite game in the world, they want to find problems with it. Not to get them addressed not to get them fixed it seems like they really want to deter you from playing the game which doesn't make sense but I'm a different breed I play all games so I will definitely tell you straight up what's wrong with the game what I like what I dislike let's get started when I first started playing matter way before I even get into that we're playing with I'm no man very first game you know I gotta show it to you I don't care whether I have a very positive score or negative score, it doesn't matter. I gotta show you my first game. But anyways, what up, I'm Nomad. Definitely rock with me all night. And then downside Rambo join later and I'll show you a couple of those games as well. But the first thing I noticed, off bat, drop shotting has definitely changed. It's slower. And also on top of that, not only is the drop shot slower, it seems like you die a lot faster, so I find myself not getting in too many situations where I can successfully drop shot because I'm dying so fast. So a lot of people feel like, oh, that's lag comp. You're dying fast because of lag comp. I don't really too much notice that when I was playing. I didn't really too much notice that. At least not of the level that you can notice on Modern Warfare 3. I didn't notice like horrible lag comp. I just feel like you just you just die fast. That's that's just what I feel. <laughs> uh, the game looks amazing though. Like I didn't put any color corrections on this, but just looking at it from my screen, even on my hub hog recording in 720p, the game looks pretty nice on console. Not even going to lie, I love the HUD. I love what they did with it. Um, I love the 10 point system. There are definitely so many possibilities that I can do with it. But of course, starting off, you don't have as many options as you would as you get up there in level. So. I will definitely do some experimenting with that, but I'm pretty sure there will be some interesting uh, little setups that people will come up with, and I know that people have already been doing it with the little online thing that they had with the 10-point system, so I'm pretty sure there will be some mad cheese classes, but there will be a lot of unique classes in this game. For the maps, the maps, me and Nomad. <laughs> oh my bad <laughs> yo I'm tripping off this instrumental at that point <laughs> but anyways as far as the maps me and I'm Nomad pretty much agreed on every map that we ate uh, cargo was one uh, turn was it turnstile whatever that map is is way too big and the people we were playing of course we were playing some YouTubers this is D for dummies I know I recognize the name before but oh my god man yeah that's that's Camp City and a lot of these other maps, like Cargo, for example, there are just way too many corridors. Way too many corridors. And the people that played it early did definitely get this one right, even though I didn't want to accept their opinion because the game wasn't officially out yet. But this one doesn't really matter about player skill or connection. There are tons upon tons of head glitching spots. Oh my god. All over the damn place. If I see someone in a head glitching spot, I don't even go after them heads on anymore because I know what the deal is going to be. Nine times out of ten, I'm going to lose. I use head glitching spots every now and then, but you know me, I keep it moving. So I don't, I don't too much stay in one spot unless there are just a whole bunch of enemies uh, right there by me, and I have to stay right there. But head glitching spots are crazy. So if you're one of those wings of redemption types of dudes, you'll probably love it. I'm pretty sure. He, he may or may not be loving the game, you know, I had to check out his channel and see what he thinks Because, you know, he's a big-ass crybaby, but we'll see what he thinks about it But he should love it, though, he should love just camping, <laughs> you know As far as spawns, spawns are definitely convoluted right now I feel like they're a little bit on the bad side, uh, even worse than Modern Warfare 3 I don't know if it's the people that are making the spawns flip so fast or what, but 
spawns definitely flip at the drop of a dime. I find that my whole team is on one side. One dude spawns behind us. And then as I'm trying to kill him and turn around, then the rest of the team spawns behind him too. And I'm like, damn, you know, that was fast. Like, I'm still trying to figure out the spawns, but there's still no real, no real equation or algorithm as far as figuring out these spawns as it is right now. I'm pretty sure some of the pub stompers have figured out already and they're going ham, but uh, I definitely have not yet. So those are those are the issues, I would suppose, but I'm going to let you know. Kill confirmed is definitely going to be my game type. And low streaks, low streaks are king in this game. Oh my lord, NASA would love it. Low streaks are definitely king. But get trying to get all these high streaks, you know, I'm going to put them on every now and then just to try it out. But I'm feeling the low streaks, and especially kill confirmed where I'm picking up mad tags and just getting kill streaks out the ass. It's amazing, y'all. So definitely try that out. Don't try to go for the high streaks, especially since it's so much harder in this game to get them. I'm pretty sure I won't see too many people rocking the dogs or rocking the swarm or rocking the warship. Probably won't see that at often unless you see it out of a care package. At least playing against me. Because I'm not going to let you get there. <laughs> that's a very high, you know, those a very high ass streak. So, rock the low streaks, people. Anyways, if you is done, let me know what you think. I'm out, y'all. Peace.